Howdy from Arlington, Texas, y'all. Hope this video finds you well. It has been a while since I've done a throwback Thursday. Hoping to get back in the groove on that again. Uh, may even take a few hours this weekend and just bank up uh, bank up a handful of them. Maybe enough to get me through the next month or two. Um, so in front of you, I talked about these two channels on my Mail Day video. 3B Collection and Shoebox Legends. Um, would still encourage you to check out both those channels. On Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern, I will be on the 3B Collection channel live again. We're going to do another hobby roundtable. It's the second one. Um, some of the others that will be on it, and these are their YouTube accounts, are 1 Million Cubs, Mark Hoyle 4, Royals 417, KBO Collections, Korean Cardboard, Texas Card Dude, Junk Wax Twins, and Saber Geek, also known as Uncle Rich Klein, who is a hobby legend. Uh, most of those guys have YouTube channels as well, so I do encourage you to go search them out and uh, hopefully give them a sub. So anyway, one pack today. One of my favorite sets. 1991-92 Skybox Basketball. Somebody sent these to me, and I can't recall for the life of me who it was. I can't remember if it was Tony, Tony's Hobby Vault. I can't remember if it was Big Shep. I can't remember if it was Brent Morrison. I'm sorry to whoever sent it to me. Usually my memory is good, but, you know, I'm starting. I'm, I'm in middle age now, so the memory's starting to go a little bit. But whoever it is... And it's in one of my previous mail videos, I'm sure. Uh, thank you. This is one of my favorite sets. I want to buy a box or two of this, or a few boxes of this, and put the set together, but not at current prices. And the scary thing is, even when these prices go down, how much of this stuff's going to be left out there unopened and available? So, you know, it, it may never come back down. But let's see what we got. I do not know for sure if this is Series 1 or 2. Um purple and yeah, i don't know maybe i'm gonna go with series one open carefully don't want to tear the pack up because i'll probably use it as a display in the front if i ever am able to complete this set and binder it up well there's card number six sydney probably moncrief but i could be wrong but so i want to say this is probably series one so we have delaney rudd Somebody was posted, oh, it was Wax Museum PC. He had bought a lot of basketball cards and pages. And as much as I like these cards by themselves, when you get these in, maybe this came from Joey. Maybe this came from Dub Mentality. That might be who this came from. Anyway, when you get these in pages and you get all of the different background designs, to me, it looks even better. That's probably the first time I'd seen it and noticed it and paid attention, but they look even better side by side with all of the different backgrounds and i mean they did a good job they put individual effort into every single card i wish we could say that uh our current card producers do that frank burkowski lionel simmons all rookie team gerald wilkins stoiko vrankovic okay i really do not remember him Rodney McRae, Jeff Hornacek, David Greenwood, Winston Bennett from the Cavs, Larry Smith, Jerome Lane, best single game performances and rebounds. Did I say Larry Bird? Larry Smith. I don't know. I said Larry Bird. Got Larry Bird on the mind. Uh, 25 rebounds, each of them. Good old Danny Ferry. Craig Hodges, Chris Jackson, Larry Nance, and I was right, it was Sidney Moncrief. So like I said, I love these cards. If you have a bunch of commons sitting around that you don't want, hit me up, let me know, because that might be the best way for me to go ahead and just build a set is just to get a lot or a few lots of commons and then just fill in from there via sport lots. But that is my look at 1991-92 Skybox. Hope everyone has a great day, and I will see you down the road.